According to the Census Bureau in 1960, the number of African-American children who lived in single-parent homes was around 22%. Today, that number has risen to a staggering 64%. What is the explanation for this phenomenon, and what effect has this extraordinarily high rate of black children being raised in single-parent homes had on the black community as a whole? And does the black community need strong, intact nuclear families to be successful? I think that the black community does actually need strong nuclear families, but not because we're black, but because that's the natural order. Amen. And so I think it would be safe to say that Reese may not be a Christian because when God looked at man, he said it's not good for man to be alone. He gave him a woman. He didn't Amen. give him a village. He didn't give him the community. He said, be fruitful and multiply to this man and this woman. So it's supposed to be God, husband, wife, child. And that's the natural order. And that's why I think we can see some of the foolishness that we see in the black community because we are out of order. I'm from a single parent home and I'm not somewhere cracked out in the street selling my body. However, that is not ideal. It would have been better for me to be in God's order to have a mother and a father to raise me. And that's just what it is. We've had women for generations now saying that they don't need a man and we have boys that don't want to be one. Bars. Bars. 